Tony Bacigalupo with New York City's here. Just two quick things I wanted to share from the weekly Q&A call that I had with the members of my group at New York City's, one of which is um, the weekly newsletter and getting more people to look at the announcements that you have to share. One of my members expressed her frustration when members ask her questions about things that she talks about in her newsletter, in her newsletter every week. And so uh, there was one thing that I learned visiting the offices of Gary Vaynerchuk that I thought were super useful, which is that they post a printout of their regular update um, in their bathroom stalls. Uh, in addition to on the walls and in the kitchen and things like that. So it's just one other way of taking a thing you're already creating and then making it available in other forms of media. And that means you could also post it on your social media or in your internal discussion groups as well. Once you're able to take your email update that you might be putting a lot of work into putting in your newsletter and share that even across paper or across other forms um, makes things a lot easier. But the bathroom stall is a really good one. And uh, it could actually lead to some fun prompts if you're starting to activate those spaces, your walls in your space, and in particular the bathroom, where maybe you can create some interactive spaces. Um, at Office Nomads in Seattle, they actually have a blackboard uh, paint on the back of the door of each of their restrooms, and they have little prompts. So it creates kind of a nice, slightly subversive, slightly transgressive activity that people can do, uh, and just creates a really fun vibe. So one thing that I think is super useful if you want to get more eyeballs on your newsletter. The other thing is an operational thing, which is at the front desk dealing with, in particular, part-time members who are coming in. If you don't have software that is tracking that automatically, then one of the things you can do is to have just a very simple system for whoever's sitting at the front desk to have a couple of documents open. Um, ideally, you have a computer that's set up at your front desk that anyone who sits there can just log in and, and have access to the different tabs of information that you're tracking. But even if not, you might have just a little post-it note reminding people to open up these tabs. One of them is a log of what happened that day. And that can just be a Google Doc. Uh, you could make it more sophisticated, but it could just be a very simple document. Um, noting, when did you come in? If you're running the front desk, when did you arrive? Who was already there when you arrived? Who showed up throughout the day? What happened that's interesting? Did somebody try to deliver a package? Did somebody come in uh, asking for more information? They said they're going to come back tomorrow. Anything you can do to make it easy for that person sitting at the front desk to hand it off to the person who is going to be sitting at the desk the next day. And that's important because if you're running a small space, if you're short on, um, on funds to be able to pay full-time labor, if you can have volunteers sitting at the front desk and easily passing information along to each other because you might have a rotating group of people taking different shifts throughout the week. Um, having a really simple system in place to just document what's been going on um, makes things so much easier. So simple document uh, that you have open on a tab on whatever computer is at the front desk and a very simple procedure for that makes things so much easier. So uh, print out your newsletter and just keep a very simple member log uh, a, a, a simple activity log of what happens every day when you're running a space without a huge number of members when you're let's say under 100 or under 50 a day uh, in total members um, you should be able to keep track of who comes and goes every day pretty easily so there you go some handy tips for more check out the details in the comments check out nwc.co where i'm offering all kinds of stuff to help you build an amazing shared community space take care bye